Paul Binks here. There have been a bunch of huge changes to Marvel Snap recently, and a big one a lot of people are discussing is the change to Sandman, which is now a 500G7 power, so plus three power, but it is now an on reveal that says players can only play one card next turn. So a lot different than it used to be, you know, instead of being able to uh, play this out and lock your opponent out the rest of the game for like four, five, and six if you ramp it out, uh, then you can only get one turn of activation for it, but it's a much better statted card. Uh, the deck I tried it out in is a new Corvus ramp, uh, which utilizes both Electro and Corvus to be able to ramp up to our giant cards. Uh, with the Corvus line, obviously Hella ends up being a great finisher for us, but it's really great if we Corvus away our Sandman, uh, we can then Hella on turn five to be able to get the sandman trigger and then just finish out with anything we need on turn six we have doom and leader which are two just wonderful ways to close things out uh this was also done on the uh castle zemo hot location so sending over our opponent electro was great but uh we won a, a bunch of different ways as you will see with the highlights ahead uh overall this deck did incredibly well uh legion was a surprise superstar this card uh, is so fun and amazing right now and could do a really really good things and people don't really expect it so a great thing to utilize. Uh, we had about a 67, I think, percent win rate with this uh, in top 1,000 infinite. So super, super solid deck. Uh, I'm really excited to try more ramp combinations with Sandman now that it's changed. And I hope you enjoy. As always, if you're enjoying this content, make sure to hit the like button. Check down below. Make sure you subscribe. Catch you live at twitch.tv slash banks underscore plays. Enjoy. You peace. I wish I had a follow up. We don't. Goblin Zemo into Odin. Oh, based. Just take your time. Make your way over there whenever feels right for you, Electro. No one's watching. Stop looking. Thank you. No reason to Corvus. Let's just vision. Vision and vibe. Probably Magento right next turn. Could just Sandman, but uh, obviously they have Electro, so it doesn't quite matter. This should almost guarantee right. I am reborn. Should still get over top of this Morbius. It's gonna be close though. It's bigger than I thought. Uh, they could tie right, potentially. Ooh, wait, we're gonna get in trouble with this, um... This guy getting dropped on the Baxter building, huh? Legion left? If we had priority, we would get their Apocalypse, which is crazy. It still wins against Apoc Middle. We love Legion. GG's. Jeez, Legion left would have been cheeky? It was cheeky. We, we won. <laughs> Could double Electro, double Magento, then the Legion it away? It's kind of kind of tempting. Yeah, let's do that. Notorious never snapper always stay for a while. Yeah, I mean, and 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 as I learned to understand the mechanic more, I because people will say like, oh, I get to infinite, I never, I never retreat, I just stay in. And like to me, like that's one of the really beautiful parts of the game, and some of my favorite parts of the game personally. Same adjust for bounce matchups. I think it's just really good. Play it on five, your opponent can only play one card. Often ahead. It's a great thing to drop out of Hella if you play it on five. Dance your little Electros around. Doom Double Doom. All. Okay, they're full filled right. That being full filled right is wonderful for us. So we're always winning right, even there Magento can't really hurt our Doom that much. I wish we could take double Jeff, but it doesn't work. Maybe it's better to play next turn. Probably just better to play next turn. There's nothing I'll have, because I'll have 8 energy. Legion Sinister? It probably helps my opponent more than me. Okay, they can only play one card. 
the moving vision can be a bit of an issue. We're also minus five here. Uh, might we just be Leader Jeff? Leader Jeff middle seems good. It could also have Jeff. Uh, you, usually Alex plays my deck, so. Lots of brains. That is a really cool new, um... Victory. That is a really cool new new effect. Yeah, I think people really like the Galactus ramp deck that I made. In general, I think people are, are pretty, pretty happy with that one. YOLO. See Morph, play Morph, chat. Ungro on four deck at the time was insane. Moon girl on four deck. Psychotic spot to Zemo, by the way. Oh, problem is, you might still be in a lot of trouble. We're never winning middle. And we can't play a card next turn. Oh, snap. They don't know that's a great point. It's <laughs> a really good point, they don't know. Moving everything. Sh movement. Vision leader in the pool. I don't really want a Sandman right now. Mm. I kind of just want to watch their cards go all the way across the board. Yeah, enough said bot is the king of uh, posting really good breakdowns of all the cards when they come out. Slide to the right. Ooh, crisscross. Boom, boom, crisscross. Cha cha, real smooth. Sandman's kind of ineffective. I wonder if we're just supposed to not play it. They don't even have Quinjet, so like all their cards other than Corvus, Electro, Jeff. Nebula are going to cost more than four. I think I'd rather just Doom. Maybe we'll feel like a big, big dum dum. Are ye worthy? Oh, that was a, that was a cute play. Doom rules all. Damn. Tell you what, chat, we really needed some more there. This tie's right. You would sneak in a nebula. Tying right is very valuable. Magento could be an issue. Lose to Magento, most likely. Take the L if it comes. Yeah, we called it. That's its nebula? Nice. Good win. Victory. Apparently we were worthy. I think we do want the points, but I mean if we're gonna play anything in the danger room, this makes sense, right? I prefer it not to die, but if it dies, it's not that big of a deal, I guess. It's always nice being ahead in danger room. Uh, we can lead her here pretty, pretty easily. Lead her in Vime. If he dies, he dies. Sam and Odin, I, I think that it's... 
something you might choose to do sometimes, but I but I don't think it's gonna be the best best thing to do in the deck almost ever. Now I'm gonna guess this is another like rampy deck, so maybe Sandman just doesn't really matter. I think Sandman right into Odin middle is very strong. They might have Sandman middle. Yeah. Please don't die. You'll make me look like an idiot. Thank you. Uh, I'm not going to calculate how we lose. There's plenty of ways that we lose here, but I'm not going to calculate them, so. Like, leader left gets us, I think. Fairly certain leader left gets us. Please go middle as well. You. Wait, we still win. <laughs> Cannonball me, you fool. A lot of ramp mirrors. Doing tunes? Oh, you're right. I haven't been doing the Sandman song. Why does the game hate me, man? Huge leader? Hey man, 2-9? Pretty good. You got anything cool in your cosmetic shop? I have the beast emote and then a couple of avatars. Nothing crazy. Try Doom Odin. It's clearly not going to work with their Modok stuff, but strong. Doom rules all. See? What's interesting is that if, if we get their Modok. We, we play Proxima Midnight and we clear hand for Strong Guy. Not that we're fighting for left, probably, but... Still quite funny. We have the legendary line chat. We have the Hella Odin line. The nearly unbeatable. Might be a mirror of some sort. A lot of people are playing rant today. Legendary T3. Oh, legendary. Any Hearthstone fans in chat? Sorry, Feet, Feet. Ah, it's just, uh, I had a bunch of personal stuff to do with today that I uh, will not be talking about on stream. But, we're here.
Yeah, I, I think that uh, Electro is just such a such a sit, like straightforward archetype to play right now. All right, the only way this fails is if we double hit left, which is a one in nine. Move vision left. Ah. You know, I was actually, hilariously, I was thinking about moving Jeff left. I can undo turn. I was thinking about moving Jeff left, but then I realized I couldn't move him back. Wonder after allocation leads is Electro Vi Viper is a viable play. I mean, it's always kind of been a viable play. It's just not good. <laughs> oh no, they got my Hella! Panic. Yeah, this is this is kind of just the god line of the the deck. It's so incredibly hard to beat. Jeff Wright too. Why? They they have just as many opportunities to move their cards from middle as we do. I just I don't I don't think we're losing here. Hey, thinks Odin leader wins. They will get two hellas. That's a lot of Hellas. I mean, there's not even many low rolls either. Like, like what the, what's the worst thing? Like Electro Sandman? Maybe Electro Leader if we have a full lanes. I think regardless, we're in a great spot. That's not going to be enough, buddy. Minions to me. Same man. Blocked us from castle rolling. Victory. I want ramp anyway. Crazy. I don't think I've ever seen one card played on the first four turns. Top deck doom? Nah, leader's so good here. Leader's cracked. What if wave we begin with this? Uh, it, you keep missing ramp. I mean, it sucks when you miss ramp, but usually when you miss ramp with decks like this, you just retreat for one. I have thought about maybe cutting Nebula for wave. The problem with wave right now is that a lot of people are just running giant six drops in their deck. They're, they're just hucking. They're just hucking enormous six drops in their deck. They, they got punished for having a bigger leader. Heading <laughs> Nebula, so few low cards. I mean, that's the point of ramp decks. You all in on ramping into big cards and beat them there. That was a funny game. You're getting rid of Havoc? What if this there's a 25% chance this is the location they want to play Havoc, you maniac? Little freak.
Hal Orton was goaded. So true. Why you put Electro back in your hand? Weird energy. Should I just play dinosaurs left over and over again? Nah, now we sand in. Dinosaur! Ho ho ho. Ho 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 ho. Blob can't move, man. Did I just take their blob? How do they have five cards left in their deck? This didn't need anything. Wait, we might just never beat Blob Middle. Because it's always going to get to 33. Wait, it'll eat my deck, too. Oh, mine will get to 33. Yeah, frick you, buddy. Give me that blob. I forgot that I re-triggered for me. I was like, oh, I'm only getting 18. That's not true. <laughs> Victory. So Red Guardian is a meta-based tech card, very similar to Scroll. There will be some metas where Red Guardian will be like, why isn't everyone putting this in their deck? It's broken. There will be some metas where the card sucks. It is my guess as to what will happen. Could be wrong. Yeah, I'm still okay, I think. I want snap back though, because I have to skip this turn, which sucks. But I should just win right, right? How are they gonna win middle and left? Got Electro, but I think that Doom left, Odin left just beats everything. Or maybe Doom left, Leader left? Because their Zemo is still active. How are they going to win here? Jubilee's good for that. left right go up four here go up 11 left 10 left it's always funny when people snap on you and you discard hella and it's like oh, i don't i really don't care <laughs> the, i was more mad what was the five drop that i lost i was honestly more mad about losing sandman than losing hella losing sandman was worse for me than losing hella That's how you get AQ cast rules. Victory. Uh, do you believe Zabu returned to previous text? Like, do I want it to go back to what it was? Uh, no. I, I kind of, I'm excited to see what happens with Zabu out of the meta. Zabu has been a cornerstone of the meta for a long time. What I get? Free hope. I just need an Odin for this. Did I discard Odin? Didn't. So we take our Hella now. Snap. We take our Hella now. We hope to get Odin. 
Or we can try and dig through our deck to re-trigger Odin to get their Red Skull. Dude, they are... Minions to me. They believe in themselves. Doom rules all. Friendly neighborhood Spider-Man here. If we don't get Odin straight up. Not getting Odin straight up kind of sucks. You know what we could do? We could quantum tunnel their Red Hulk. I it's too funny. I must I simply must do this. What kind of person would I be if I didn't? And you know they're playing Red Hulk. Man, I wish I had moved the leader now. <laughs> Get over here, by the way. Let's let's make this a, a, a real ass casserole. Oh no! It's a freaking silk, man. No, they didn't get casserole, dude. What a what an insane casserole dodge. What an absolutely next level casserole dodge that was. Yeah, I mean, if you pay $10 a month, you can get just about all you need to be competitive. You, you're snapping on this. Minions to me. You're snapping on Gladiator Bar Sinister. That is, that is insane to me. Doom rules all. Congratulations, you've thinned my deck. I really hope that... Ah, uh, man, I can't Legion right. Hmm. I can't Legion right because I lose right. I wish I could. And then just like four stack any cards that they play. Probably just vision, right? It's so hard to say no to vision here. Congratulations. You have you have all of my cards. You have every si you have every single one of them. That that much I know I know is true. Question is how do we win? We have a million ways to win, right? I think leader is actually bad, because it takes up my board space. I think the play is actually just to Odin. Play the biggest card, then just huck all our visions left and play Magento right. Are ye worthy? Now if this pulls uh this Doc Ock pulls Magento, now we're in trouble. Not Sarah. Good luck! It's such a funny play, uh, snapping on Bar Sinister Gladiator. Like, it's, it's just not that good. 
<laughs> like, like what, what does it do? Surfer? They need two Surfer triggers. Which they, like, could get, but then they only tie, right? And then we should beat them on every other lane by, like, a ton of points. So two Surfer triggers is all they can do. Now, maybe they have... No, they can't even, like, Surfer Hazmat. It, it is funny, I guess. I mean, I don't... I don't know. I just have, like... I don't know. I just, I just look at... Like, the idea of, like, milling stuff is, like, is not very good. You know, I should have moved one vision here last turn. That was actually a pretty big mistake. cube casserole. Victory. Great board is better now that you can animate it? Uh, I mean, it's better, yeah. I still don't like it. I'm happy other people like it. I just don't really like it that much. Ah! This is fine. We just Corvus, Hella, hopefully Odin. We keep the Nebula in hand to give us our chance for a Wombo combo. Ink with Grey Border looks so good, Imo. It's awesome. I'm glad that you like it. No! gonna do about this shit, huh? Oh no, Chad! I can only play right! What am I gonna do? Fucking get wrecked, dude. <laughs> oh, man. Get destroyed! Get absolutely cooked! <laughs> Victory. I love Legion, dude!